Hello and welcome to an original You Try This production. Today I'll be teaching you how to make a basic player in Game Maker. Yeah. I'll be remaking all my tutorials from We Try This production. So, yeah, in my new We Try This tutorial engine, much needed than the last one. So, yeah. So, to create a player, all you have to do, hold on, I have to rename this. Black player. Okay. So all you have to do is have two sprites. I just figured out how to do this like five seconds before I made this tutorial. So yeah, all you need to do is have one facing the right direction and one facing the left. It's so much neater than using two sprites for one for each direction. So yeah. So we'll create an object now. OBJ underscore calm black layer because I'll have some more, add some more later in my later tutorials. Let's give them the sprite. So what we're going to do, add event, create. I might use drag and drop and code in my tutorials also. So let's go, no. Let's go to the uh, control tab, set variable. Uh, let's just make it change sprite. Make him change sprite into black player. Now his first sub image, um, let me show you guys. His first sub image is zero, which is him facing the right direction. And the second image one is him facing the left. So what we're going to do here, change sprite, sub image zero, so we'll start off at facing the right direction and a speed of zero. So it won't change his sprite, it'll just stay on his right direction. So that's when he's created. Let's make him a solid now. So let's add event, key press left. Now we're going to make a move and change directions. So sprite, player, black player, sum image zero, speed of zero. Oh wait, we press left. So since sub image one is him facing the left direction, this is what it should be, speed of zero. And then we'll use Z speed, I mean H speed. So we have horizontal speed, make it negative six. Negative is for the left. And so add event, key press right. And let's do the same thing. Let's copy this. Except let's change this to zero for him facing the right direction. And set the horizontal speed to six. Apply it to self. Okay. Now just add our key release events. Key release is much easier to do than no key because if you're accidentally pressing a button by accident, your player won't stop moving. So yeah. So let's go use set vertical speed. I'm set horizontal speed to zero. Just copy this. And there we have it. We have our basic player. Let's create a wall object or a floor. Create sprite. I'll make it 16 by 16. Okay. Oh, wait. we're good for now. Transparent. SPR underscore wall. Or in this case, floor. Create into an object. OBJ underscore floor. Sprite. SPR underscore floor. Solid. And now we're going to add some events into the player object for gravity. So let's add event, step, step. Oh, um, let's see, we use check empty. So if position is collision free. Zero, one, or object only solid relative. Add some gravity. Position is collision free. What we're going to do, we're going to, um, what's it called? Set the gravity, direction 270, 0 0.5. So I think this um, sets the gravity downward. I'm not sure, I forgot. But it works. So else, set the gravity, direction 270, gravity 0. Um, wait, wait, wait. Hold on, one second. 
Okay, never mind. So let's make a jump, I guess. Keep press. Up. I'll put these in separate tutorials just for reference, I guess. So we have, um, wait, where is it? Control. So hold on. You know, uh, it check collision. It position is collision free. Zero one, only solid, relative. So it's relative to the player's current position. We uh, set the vertical speed to, uh, let's see, what do we want? This depends on what you want your jump to be. I'll make mine negative 10. So it goes up 10. But the gravity will bring him back down, so, yeah. Oh, we also have to add a collision event with the wall or the floor. So, um, where is it at? Move category. This here, move to contact. Direction, direction, maximum 30 against solid objects. And set the vertical speed to zero. And there we have it. We have our basic player. So I'll show you what this looks like. Crater room. I'll call it basic room. And let's put some objects. I'll put a floor here. I'll change that color later. And let's show you the gravity. Okay, let's play it. Hold on, or fast forward this a little. Okay, well here it is. Our player, you jump. Press the left button, he changes directions. Press the right button, he changes directions. Press the up, he jumps. No collision problems. So yeah. Pretty simple. This has been a retry this production. Hope you enjoy. Don't forget to subscribe.